right. Um, well, it looks like we have uh, one patient to go over today. Yes. Um, and so we have him set up uh, with a three-piece Lafort. Were you planning on doing some sagittal splits for this or just that Lafort? Yes, yes, uh, double jaw. He wants, uh, you know, both jaws uh, enhanced. Uh, and, okay. Uh, uh, let's let's verify his head position, you know, um, with mm -hmm. uh, with, the, with the facial markers that I placed. Just wanna... Yeah, certainly. Let me pull pull up this soft tissue here, and we'll take a look at that. Okay, so that's there. I'm trying to see that other marker on the uh, left, mm -hmm. on the left side on the cheek. I don't see. Uh, is it? It's not showing up. Well, yeah, it doesn't look like it came through there. And uh, yeah, but that that seems very close. Seems to be pretty good. Uh, 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 can we see uh, see the side view, please? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. and that looks. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty vertical there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that should be that should be good at position there. Okay. All right. Perfect. Um. So it looked like his upper dental midline was pretty much on with facial. Is that what you were seeing yes. as well? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, perfect. All right, so I'll come into uh, that final occlusion. Yes. And then it looks like um, when we're segmentalized, there's really no no cant induced, um, so we're looking pretty good there. Yes. Uh, what sort of AP or vertical movements were you thinking? Uh, we're thinking uh, doing uh, nine... Uh, 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 let's start with nine millimeters uh, forward on the maxillary incisor. Okay. And so if we come forward nine at those uh, upper incisors there, the lower incisors come forward about six, and your chin comes forward about nine. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, <clears throat> so then we wanted to do um, a vertical increase of about three millimeters because right now he is... Uh, I think he's minus two on the record there. Okay. Yeah, so he's minus uh, the two on the incisor show, which rests. So we're gonna do approximately three, maybe three and a half millimeters down. Okay. Mm -hmm. And do you wanna leave that posterior in contact there, or do you wanna bring that down three as well? Uh, I, uh, I, I think we're gonna. Um, uh, keep the posterior in the contact because this way we can bring that chin back a little bit. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. So now we, uh, what, what are we at the pogonia now at the chin? Uh, we're about seven and a half forward. Okay. Okay, that's good. And then um, we're about nine millimeters at the uh, upper jaw forward and. Uh, Osteotomy is not that bad, right? It's uh, just uh, the lower jaw osteotomy is, is about, uh, the, the gap is about, what, six millimeters or so? Mm-hmm. Let me get that lined up here for you. You're about seven on that right side. Mm -hmm. And about six on the left. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, okay. So I think uh, let's do half millimeter more forward, like nine and a half at the incisor then. And okay. I, and I think that'd be uh, pretty good. And then maybe we can increase the occlusal plane to now it's minus five. So maybe, mm -hmm. maybe do it minus. Uh, Seven. Okay, so that'll bring your chin forward uh, seven here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, and then I can uh, lengthen it if I have to. So I think that's uh, that's pretty reasonable, and that will give him some good, uh, you know, incisor show and uh, everything. Mm -hmm. uh, so we increase the occlusal plane by uh, a total of four degrees here. Oh, increase by four. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. So, what's the average you guys uh, see? But mm -hmm. the average occlusal plane is normally between eight and twelve. Yeah. So we're on the low end, but um, eight, but not too far to that. Yeah, eight and twelve minus uh, eight and twelve, right? Correct. Correct. 
yeah, yeah. So seven is not horrible. And uh, do you think we should do eight on him? Um, if we look at, let me flip him to the other side. Mm -hmm. That left side's a little steeper. Um, about just over eight there, so. Yeah, it should be okay, yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, I think that's uh, okay. th that's very reasonable. And then I'll work on the chin. If, if, if you want, let, let's do the little chin osteotomy and just uh, mm -hmm. kind of uh, advance it uh, down just a little bit. It's, it's a little short there. You just want to lengthen it. Yeah, uh, you know, do, do, yeah, exactly like open book like this. Yeah, perfect. Uh huh. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. That's lengthening it about four millimeters there. Yeah, 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 perfect. That's that's what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think that's. And if we do look from. Yeah, yeah, I think that's. Uh, Pretty good okay. there. Um, just looking from the front, it does look like there's maybe a little asymmetry in the front for that chin as well. Uh, yeah, I may just, just lengthen one, one side a little bit more than the other. Yeah, uh, I'll play. Okay. With, yeah. I'll play with that, and uh, uh, I think that's pretty much it. Can, can we look at the facial profile on the soft tissue, if you don't mind? Yeah, let me. Um, I'll pull up a pre and post up here. So pre ops on the left and post ops on the right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Perfect. And then, yeah, if I have to, I'll work on the chin a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's, uh, yeah, that's something where uh, it's reasonable for him. Yeah, perfect. Okay, all right, perfect. Well, um, are you going to be doing the mandible first here? Yes, yes, yes. Actually, be um, not too big of an intermediate splint there. Mm -hmm. That'll be that intermediate position. And um, that intermediate splint will just have no flange in that tongue cradle. Yes. And then the final splint will put uh, some wiring holes and a little bit of palatal buildup on it as well. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. And surgery is uh, this coming Tuesday, is that correct? Yes. Okay. We'll get started on this and ship it out to your office on 911 Reserve Drive, Suite 150. Yes. All right. Well, thank you for getting on this morning and enjoy the rest of your day, Dr. Andapov. Perfect. Thank you so much, Hannah. Thank you. No problem. Bye. Bye-bye. Uh -huh.